And so we're going to put some of that down. I'm going to need some more white paint. I'm really digging these Dina Wakely paints. However, I um, saw Susie Dennis was painting with some paints out of a jar, and I asked her, and she said they are Nova. Oh gosh. They're Nova something paints, and they're, she said they're wonderful. You can only buy them online, but there is a store in California, so the people in California can find the store. I will put it in, if I remember, I'll put it in the description below. It's YouTube, of what they're called. They're Nova something. Nova Color. That's what it is, Nova Color. Um, I looked on their store online and they're about, I want to make sure I get this paint off of this stamp. It looks like for four ounces, they're like five bucks a bottle. Mm, that's not quite in my price range, but for a good paint, I guess it would be if they are, and Susie Dennis uses them and she said they're wonderful paint. So I'm taking her word for it. And so I guess that's not a bad price. All right. That's the... Now see, this is the Target one. And I don't like it. I just don't like it. I like this, whatever one this is. Generic. But anyway... Now, I love this mark, this one. I don't know what it is, but when you mark, put these marks down in with white paint, oh my goodness, it's beautiful. It almost looks like a flower of some sort. It's beautiful. So we're going to do that. And I don't know if you're going to be able to see it real clear. But I'll put it up to the camera so you can see when I stamp it. So, ladies, if you don't have these spun, these foam mark things, get you some. Go to Michael's. They're not expensive. Or maybe somebody will gift you some. But they are wonderful. Can you see that on there? Here. Let me see if I can zoom you in. Can you see how that went? Isn't that cool looking? It's right there. See it? Looks like a flower right there. I love that mark. I like them all. Okay. Let me zoom you back out. Alrighty, how's that? Okay. I'm going to put a little uh, on this one. I think I'm fading my paint out with white. Oh well, I will fix it. Okay guys, I'm going to use this other one, other wet wipe to wipe this off. I had black ink on here from 
when I was stamping with it before that I, I didn't think would come off because it was permanent ink. And guess what? It's coming off. Okay, I like this one better. Oh well. Now we're gonna use this one and it makes a zigzag like the chevron, but we're gonna use the ink with this. Because I have um, faded this out with the white, so I wanna put some more dark into it. I'm not gonna do much. That smoke's coming back in the house pretty strong. I quit smoking about three years ago. It has been three years. I had my stomach operation and I couldn't handle the smoking and I was quite a heavy smoker. And I enjoyed smoking, I, but I enjoy the money now that I have <laughs> the extra money. I have because I can use it on my craft stuff. Okay. Alrighty. Now I'm going to put some other marks in here with these lids that I have. Make some... That's why I wanted to not put the black paint on there yet. Here we go. This is so thick and yummy, it's like butter. You know what I saw somebody do? And I wish I could remember to do this before I pour out black paint. They would take a black marker, permanent marker, and go around their lid top and uh, put it on. I know I could spread this out and maybe do it that way, but... I've got this brush in here now. I wish I'd remember that before I pour out black paint. You guys, remind me that next time. Right, okay. Let's try this. That worked pretty good. This is a lid off of my boost. I decided I better get some nourishment in me, get some vitamins in me, because I wasn't eating anything else. So, drank some boost, and it didn't work. I don't know how much stayed in my system, but I lost six pounds. So you know, too much didn't stay in there. Too many calories didn't stay in. But I'm better now. I'm feeling better now. Bell's feeling better now. I think we're on the upsweep of this. Hopefully. Never again am I getting a flu shot ever, ever. Hopefully it'll maybe get out of my system. And even the doctor that did my uh, colonoscopy he said, you just don't know what's in those. You don't know what's... And I was surprised to hear a doctor say that. He said, you just don't know what's in the flu shot. What they're putting in them. Okay, I'm just going to go with three of those. Okay. 
I don't know. I don't think I want to go with any more little circles. I need a drink, guys. I need a drink. This is probably going to take forever to load up. But you know what? It's fun to be here with you guys and talk to you. And, um, yeah, it is. Now, I think I'm going to wash that one out and get a different paintbrush, wet it, and do some more colored circles because they are just fun to do. some more paint but I did say I wanted these pastel and bright didn't I and that's what I got yay for me I just had a fun time doing this it's just really just laid back painting you don't have to think about it you just do it and it comes out I'm so surprised it just comes out And I'll mark on it and make marks and play around. Just play around. Just be relaxed. That's what arting is all about, isn't it? Just relaxing our... This paper wants to bulge up. I need... Sorry about the shadow. It's just relaxing and easy to do. I had a, well, she, my friend, um, back in the day when I was still married and I was going through, I, I remember I told you about my breakdown and everything and then I had some, about seven years of real deep depression. And my friend, she was my neighbor and my, I thought, my best friend. You always know who your friends are when you get well. <laughs> They're not your friends anymore. They want you to stay sick. My therapist told me that. And I 